Hey guys, welcome to Studio Wildlife. In today's video, I'm going to show you how amber paint an elephant in watercolours and tell you a little about some of the things I'm planning to do with this channel. So, obviously, there was something new there. I just thought I'd give something a go, try out making a little introduction. Please let me know in the comments what you thought about that and whether I should carry on doing it or whether maybe I should just scrap that idea of an introduction altogether. And um, I would really like to hear from you guys, so please make sure to drop a comment down below. Unfortunately, because of national lockdown here in the UK, Amber can't actually be here to record her video, so I'm just gonna do it for you. I'll have a little bit of voiceover telling you about what the painting was for, and then other than that, I'll just let you watch the time lapse. As always, if you enjoy the video, please make sure to give it a like and subscribe to the channel. It means so much to us. Anyway, let's get started. If you want to learn more about painting an elephant, I already have one video up showing you how I painted an elephant in acrylic paints. And I am planning to do a more in-depth tutorial on how to paint a detailed elephant. If you'd like to see a more detailed elephant video, please let me know in the comments below. So over the last month or so, me and Amber have been involved in a wildlife charity exhibition. It was called Artists for Painted Dogs and it involved us donating some artwork with 50% of the proceeds going towards wild dog conservation. It was set up by a bunch of fantastic artists and involved a load of fantastic wildlife artists and photographers. In total, we managed to raise over £32,000 for wild dog conservation, which is an amazing feat, and we're so happy to have been invited and so happy to have been involved. As part of the exhibition, we decided to do some small field sketch, almost like work, and for this, we just decided to do small little sketches that we could put up for £100, with £50 of that going towards a wildlife charity. Between us, I think we sold about five or six of those little paintings. I've done a tiger, another elephant, a bear and a leopard. Amber sold a couple of wild dogs, this elephant and something else that I can't remember the name of. Together we've made a little bit of money for this wildlife conservation charity which is absolutely fantastic. As always, thank you so much for watching, and if you enjoyed the video, please make sure to give it a like, and please, please do click that subscribe button. For more wildlife art tips, please head over to studiowildlife.com.